Hmm, what's up boys and girls? And all you other fun-filled people. How are we today? I'm doing quite well, actually. <clears throat> Decided to do some, um, some mission running in my little boat here. I've actually gotten to where I really love this boat. Which is sad, because I don't have really good training in this boat. I think I've got mastery one done on this, but I'm working on the other ones. Slowly but surely. Let's see, El Galinde. This is the Navy issue vexer. Yep. Yep. See, skill one. Uh, but I do, alas. Matter of fact, now that I think about it, the only ships I've got second or anything above that in this game. <laughs> are Mahali bits. Yeah, these I have mastery too. And I have noticed that I have been neglecting the combat ships kind of bad a little bit. But we're going to try to amend that. Ooh, commando ships. Now, see this is something that I really would like to get into. It's an Astarte because it's hybrid turrets and then command burst modules and whatnot. And one of the other things aside from that that I would really like to get into at some point is not that. It is... Yes, Tactical Destroyer, the heck it. I actually have the training for it. For tier, tech, tier 1. <gasps> The problem is I do not have Galente Tactical Destroyer even learned. Which means you need Destroyer 5 and Tactical Destroyer, which I'm working on. But I figured I'd show some record rating of a few missions for our new masters, so to speak, in the Galente Federation. Uh, the pigtails are kind of killing me, and she definitely has that who the heck are you face. That, mmm, okay. Ancient peoples, there are a number of ancient races who left traces of their civilization sc scattered throughout the Eve universe. The Tecmal, masters of cybernetics and bioengineering, the Talacan, Talacan with their hyper-advanced spatial manipulations technology, and the Yanjung, who excelled in gravitronics and force field theories. Others include the mysterious sleepers, the Joves. Yep, let's do this. As you slowly start peeling back the layers, you find there is quite a bit of story and lore to this game. Oh yeah, I forgot. The scanny bits. I realize I automatically got scan sores. No, no you don't. You gotta pull it up, your directional scanners. Which I've actually set up a whole deal right here on my overview. Uh, yeah. uh, can I save this? Save current type as blop. Blop. There we go. Basically, it anytime I go somewhere, my sensors will automatically pop up there. Any sort of ship. I completely stripped it down to where it's only ships and uh, citadels. Yeah. Oh, this, sorry, I've got a cup of water here because I've set a 30-day goal for myself to drink more water. Because I realized I was pretty much only sucking down coffee, which coffee is not necessarily bad for you the way I drink it, which is just black. But you kind of need water in there too. Uh, one of the other things I did is I split up my uh, talkie bits here. Got my talkie bits, got my drones, my backups, my shredders. Yeah, I finally got around to buying myself some Granted Tech 1 salvage drones. Which, you know, come in handy. I really need to empty this. But one of the other deals... Oops, I should have left that back at base. That I have... I dropped a load of money on this, but it's so worth. It's just a mobile tractor unit, see? 
All it shows is the Cormorant. Drive active. I need to let's see. Yep, yeah, that's all spacey mining and then general. But eventually, I am wanting to train the skills to disappear into some wormy hole space. Now, I know everybody's like, why would you do that? It's dangerous. Yes, it is dangerous, but it is worth money. Way more money than I could ever hope. Unidentified. Wow, they... what? Huh? Somebody else out here. Mysterious sightings. Well, we'll see what they left. They just kind of... died. That is kind of creepy, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, we'll throw the shredders into space. Not gonna get a lot off this. This is mainly just, you know, trying to get myself used to doing this. Local Ruga. See, Federation Scout, what the hell is that? Merit, it's locking me. Shield boost engage. Target, bet. Ah, your scanners were unable to get a signature from the strange ship. You're quite sure you've never seen it. I didn't even see the ship, so how did. Yeah, of course I didn't see anything like it. Uh, what do we got? Federation Navy dog tags. Well, I'm getting dog tags off of everybody, so. And then all you gotta do over here is just hit salvage, and they automatically salvage any wreck that's, you know, in proximity. Which is handy. Let's go ahead and set this destination. Oh, this is a one of four, yeah. Sweet! But now, I'm slowly but surely trying to figure out how to play the game correctly. Kinda hard. Uh, stack it all. No, nope, sorry, stacked. Okay. Give it a second. They should automatically salvage. Oh, it's because I had the target locked. If you don't lock onto the targets in particular, and you just have a bunch of them up, they'll salvage the whole kit. Which is handy. Now the other thing that happens today, now not right now, but later after the cluster restarts, is the Christmas events. Which are going to be nice. Uh, I have been watching, and I don't know if y'all have seen my liked videos, The Lone Wolf. He does a lot more recurrent e-videos, which is cool. But I didn't even realize you can just drag and drop this stuff. <laughs> this whole time I've been like, right clink, go down, click launch, right clink, you know. Pain in the old posterior region. Let's see. Who's the Mark Group is favorite f for the launching. No, uh, that would be this one. So, yeah, favorite group. This group will be launched when using the launching drones. Yeah, well, I don't. Now that I just drag and drop, it's not that important. Alright, let's go. But yeah. I renamed this guy from Wee Man to, well, it's a noisy cricket. Mainly because of these guns. I went ahead and put some. 250 millimeter rail guns because they're the large, they're the medium rail guns, but the range, look at the range. <laughs> yeah, this thing like reaches out and slaps stuff out of the sky. All they see is this tiny little boat come out, out of nowhere and then sniper boat. That's kind of what I built this to be, is my sniper boat. We got three more hours until downtime, yep. Yep, and after the downtime, we will start getting the Christmas stuff, and I'll be showing that. Apparently, we also get Christmas presents. <coughs> so excited. Everybody loves Christmas presents. Let's see what we got. Uh, 
Remove Stargate from overview. Yeah, I technically could do that. Oh, that was the whole mission? Wow. Easiest mission I've ever done in my life. That was really quick. I was hoping to show up in Sniper Boat Build. And please remember, by no means is this boat... Would I recommend this boat for... Or the fit on this boat for anything? Like, at all. Ever. Just so it happens to be something I'm playing with. I like... I originally, I had the micro warp drive, but... It was like eating my cap alive. And I wanted a more stable fit. Now granted, I'm not going to get a whole lot off his small armor ripper. But I have a much bigger passive tank now on this. That's for the oh crap moment. And if it gets really bad, I have to overheat. Which is not recommended. You'll burn modules that way. Yeah, this is pretty easy. But yeah, I'm slowly trying to get mine in the corpse uh, standings increased by doing this. Yeah, let's go ahead and just do all four of them. While I'm at it, though. While I'm at it, let's see if we got any decent trucker rating contracts around y'all. Uh, 400 mil? Golly. See, I'd only get 3 mil for this one, but I can move this one. I can't move this one. But I can move that one. But that's like... Dark red like that is null sec, and I'd rather not. Hmm. But it only gives 300 thou. Whereas this gives 3 million. And it's to Jita. Do I have the 4 mil though to drop on that? Nah, I don't. But. I can borrow from the corp. Because the corp actually has a little bit. I'm going to borrow... Let's see, one, two, three, one, two, three. It should be a hundred, uh, that's one million. One, oh, one, two. Eh, it should be, there we go, okay. Uh, how long do I have to complete that one? Got a day. Let's go ahead and accept that. We'll end our run with this contract holy cow for once it's not taking me through low sec <clears throat> what yeah no weird right uh, budget we'll accept it yes yes I know I know accept that actually hurts a little bit when that happens but I'll get it back and then I'll put the hundred mil back into the uh, the bank because right now that's what the corp wallet is to me. I need people, please, if y'all want to join the corp, please <laughs> feel free. I need you. I need you guys in my life. There we go. Really? You have to pay money to do these jobs? Okay. Reports. You need the reports in your cargo hold. There we are, reports, cargo hold. While I'm at it though, I'm gonna empty this out, because this is a little ridic. I shift click. Now a lot, a lot of you people are going, why don't you put that on your character? Nah, not right now. Because I every time I do, every time I do, I get bopped out of the sky. Somebody boxes me your drums. There you go. Sort this. Sort by name or by type. There we go. Thank you. Alright, set the destination. I guess we're literally just running stuff, which is fine. After this, I'll go get Doomstick and we'll head out, do a little trickery. Um, nah, we'll, we'll, we'll finish the whole thing. 
As y'all know, for these I do my long let's plays. Minecraft and everything else I try to keep it short, but nah. I'm a firm believer in the long let's play. I know it's a dying uh, recording time, but I like them, personally. Yeah, I've, like I said, thought about branching off a bit. I have been watching some gameplay of some wormhole stuff. Now, all I've seen is wormhole combat sites and data sites. <clears throat> One of the ships that he recommends that I actually have no training for, but I've <laughs> contemplated getting some training for is the the Jackdaw, which is a Kaldari state ship. Which I'll pull that up real fast. Left drive active. Now granted, he, he's he been on the game a little longer than I have, so he can play absolutely everything. I, however, comma, cannot. Is it Kaldari? Or is it Amari? Yeah, here it is, here it is. Yeah, the Jack though. It's a missile boat. Ugh, go away. That way they can see this. Yeah, tactical destroyer modes. Modes by switch will no more than every defense mode. It's got a propulsion mode, sharpshooter mode. It's got all these modes, which is kind of cool. Right now, it's going for, like, dirt. But I want to try to make the heck it work for me first. Because it's pretty much the same thing. Except it's turrets. It's not, um... Uh, it's not a missile boat. So I'm gonna try it first. And then hit the jackdaw. One of the other things that he does that I have been paying attention wholeheartedly, and if you play EVE, I think you should look into as well as his EVE talk, because he actually goes over the market in EVE at this moment, and, you know, he recommends some stuff to possibly buy, some investment types to make, and I've been thinking about getting into that too, because it seems to work. He's like me, though. If I remember correctly, he's a literally a corp of one. Except he's, you know, got way more junk than I do. Alright, let's uh, complete this mission. Mission. I can request the mission here, or is it going to tell me I have to go? Yeah. So we can socialize, we can formalize, socialize, formalize, whatever. Yep, I'm coming back, darling. Astral mining. Interesting. And don't get me wrong, I am not here to say that I'm going to give up on my mining and my space trucking. I just really want a more lucrative means of this gathering. Because I'm not by any means broke. Drive active. I've actually, strangely enough, hit a point where I'm making a decent amount of money. I'm making enough to keep myself in about the same amount. Because I'm not really buying anything anymore. I've, I've bought just about everything I really want at this moment. So now it just, it's a matter of digging stuff up that I want to do. And, well, uh, trading. Like the battleships, I finally got my battleship training semi-decent. And I don't want really to hit wormhole without having at least tier 3 mastery on something. So, yeah. Uh, skill points. How many skill points do I have left at this moment? Not that many. Yeah, drones I've trained really heavily in. Electronic systems I'm training very heavily in at this moment. Yeah. Target painting, I need to get that done. Weapons distribution.
Dude, I'm still slowly but surely training on mining upgrades 5. Once that gets done, you know, we'll be moving on up. Yeah, this will give me the expedition frigates I need, because I'm wanting to do a little gas mining, but I don't want to do that in, you know, one of my big mining boats. I want to take out one of those expedition frigates, mainly because it allows me to do cloaking and wormhole jumping. The capacitor systems probably wouldn't have to do that, but I kind of want to. Just because I'm tired every time I turn around, most of my ships having to be fit with batteries just to run them. And electronic warfare, the Galente drone specialization, drone avionics. Docking permission requested. And then Docking large energy turrets. Those, yeah, I got like 30 days for that, so I'm not gonna be in my battleship, sadly, until like the end of the freaking month. But it is what it is. I am curious to see where this actually goes. Let's see. Find one of these alien ships to give me a first person account. Are you going to tell me that my junk is going to get blocked? Oh, it's my ship restrictions. Yes, I can take it. I could take a, a freaking battleship if I wanted. What's bad is I don't think this ship is insured. Yeah, let's let's see. I already know all these. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, pre holy. Oh, that's two million. <laughs> Problem is, is, this ship is worth way more than that. But we're gonna insure it. I'll get something out of it. I would go get the Deuce Coop and we'd roll out in Ant just because it's, you know, my battle cruiser. But I would rather lose this as the Deuce Coop if I'm being honest. And this boat is not terrible. Don't get me wrong. This is not a bad fit. Ugh, wow, did I really? Hang on. Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. I can't count the number of times I've done that. It's like, oh, okay, and then just exit out. Yeah, see, I never accepted the damn mission. Except. Now then, set the destination. If you are wondering why it seems a little frame jumpy, I'm actually editing, or, yeah, editing a video in the background. One of me Minecraft videos. Man, I've been gassy, I don't know why. Ah, my directional scanner. I was like, what is that? Oh, that hurt so so bad for both of us, but sadly it's still just me in the corp. Well, I say it, Oz is technically in the corp, but mm, I like Oz. I like Oz a lot. He's my friend. But I doubt I ever see him pop back on. Just being honest. Oh, autofusion ships. I would rather not. Can I look at you though? No. No, I'll end up. I end up. no look at. Dang it! Got to jump first. If you ever get a chance to take a look at those guys, you know I recommend it. They look really interesting. It's really cool. Warp drive active. You know. Just the propulsion systems and everything on those ships blow my mind. Oh, there for a second I thought we had popped over to Mimitara. I was like, great. But, uh, I did some research. I had been a fool this whole time. It doesn't... My standings aren't that bad yet. To where I can't go to a certain place. Now, they're not great. As y'all know, the Galente really mad at me. Oh, no. I'm in the positive again. Sweet. Yes. I need better connection, though. Hmm, 12 I wonder how I got a negative. 
Oh, Kaldari State. Whatever. Uh, what location? But yeah, I need to train up in connections. Matter of fact, I'm gonna see if I can't throw a little skill points that way. So that would be nice. Why did I close that? Yeah. Uh, social connections. Uh, apply skill points. Oh yeah. Three, four, nine, three. There we go. How much do I need for that? Yeah. That the reason I'm doing this also has to do with the fact that I don't want to pay as much in taxes. Taxes are eating my tail a lot, a lot. I'm here. Oh, activate the acceleration gate. I was like, what the heck is going on here? We are gonna zip. Oh, I love the new animations for the jump gates and the acceleration gates. Check that out. It like spins up. Used to, you just, you did that and you left. Now, it actually has the animation of it activating. Which I find just absolutely co- Interest, what? Is there a specific one I'm supposed to go through? Uh, what? Read the details. I guess I can go through any of them. Now we have no idea if these things are hostile, but if you told me... What you told me is true. What you saw, it's one take out a couple of Galente ships, and we need to be careful. You need to be, if you're under attack, get the hell out of there, and if not, well, just find out what you can. Don't take on un any unnecessary risks. Okay, so basically what they have just told me is I'm gonna get my teeth kicked into my throat. See, that's just, oh, that's cool. Heck, I'm pretty sure I'd have been better off just bringing a shuttle. Just in case. Okay. Unidentified ship. Okay, I've activated. I'm gonna approach. I'm gonna get very mad if I die. Because I just realized I didn't take out my freaking. my doodads. Are you supposed to zip around in around here? I'm gonna see how close I have to get before he gets mad. And then I have to run away like a little chicken. Let's see, the array is three. I came in that one. Oh, he just left. Okay, that works for me. I ain't gonna gripe. I'd rather him just leave as the meat, you know, take it to the eye. Turn off my repper and my freaking... <sighs> my afterburner. It's a really crap afterburner, I know. <laughs> Still working on everything else. Oh, I apologize. Like I said, for some reason... I've been really belchy. I think it's this chair. I've found that bad posture does not help, you know, my digestive tract. And this old chair is a little worn out. Ugh, the Galente freaking jump gates are pretty cool. The green, I love that green. Ooh, I came in on the wrong end of that conversation. Medical Mary Jane. Has to taste better than... Qu what? Bit? 
I don't wanna know. I don't wanna know. Dr. Hot. <laughs> Sometimes I wonder if people will even try to type messages correctly. Because I'm pretty sure that it was supposed to be also look at the shortcut. Yeah, chat really kills me sometimes because you'll have people that you barely can make out what they're saying. It's definitely some head scratching moments. After this one, we'll we'll do our run to Jita. Well, we're on three of four, and I'm only at thirty minutes. Fuck it, we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. We're gonna finish out the fourth, the fourth, just to see what happens. Then I'm gonna truck it to Jita. Let's all go to Jita. Let's all go to Jita. Admittedly, the Galente Federation's base docks are kind of weird looking to me. I mean, it looks like something just opened up, but at the same time, you can tell it's always like that. Yeah. Alright, start the conversation. Request mission. Fine, and give me a first person account. Oh, that's the one I just had. Okay, 404, what do we got? Destroy or drive off whatever ships are attacking the industrial. Oh, we're gonna beat the crap out of them. We're gonna start smacking people. Ooh, so hard. Let's do it. These are quick missions here, that's what I like. Oh, holy crap. I just went to level 2 missions. Ooh, I'm finally getting my standings up. I guess it was a good idea to go ahead and throw those points into connections real fast. I'm curious, what is my standings now? Warp drive active. Oh, holy crap, yeah. That helped. That helped a lot. My base standings are a point one, but because of my connections it jumped to a point one point two. Sweet. Caldari State originally didn't like me, now they love me. Mimitar, well, there's no help in that. I gotta get diplomacy going for that. But yeah, with the right skill books, you can get away with murder. Literally. So we can start doing level 2 missions. I've never ran any level 2s. I'll probably be doing those, though, in my battle cruiser. Location. Yeah, we actually made a little money there. It's better when you get missions that you can get bounties off of, though. Ugh. Sorry, I had an itch. Ooh, Dominic's. Zuzu ch chances? Zuzu. Hmm. Astrahos. Oh, that reminds me. I've got to get some. Corelli agent? <laughs> Alright, boys. We know what to do. Sniper boat time. Admittedly, I think the plutonium charges will probably be better for this. I could sniper boat, but I'm going to see what the range is. Oh, yeah. 26 kilometers. They're all within. We want to take out Big Boy first. So let's do that. Bye. Oh, I did screw up. Hang on. Stand by. Told you. Noisy cricket. I love this boat so much. Honestly, I really don't even need the drones, but might as well. Just in case something gets a little quick or a little too close. Reminds me, I actually need to 
heal my drones. And next time I'll throw out the backups. I feel kind of bad because these are technically Galente ships, but it's not the Galente Federation, so... Oh, come on. Warp something else in. This was too easy. Yep, that was it. Really? Okay. Let's throw the bees back in the bay. Throw my armor ripper on. Oh, throw the shredders out. And then just tell them to salvage everything. Yeah, that's literally it. The, um, the mobile tractor unit will pull everything close to me. It also will loot everything. So if we sit here and click on it real fast. Yeah. And then just open cargo. See? Instantly loots. So you don't even really have to move if you got a decent tank. Are y'all actually being repaired? I forget how to actually repair these guys. I know there's a wet sea. Even now, I'm a failure. <laughs> Such happy Eve music. I say that and it changes instantly that the irony of that is hilarious yeah code who is this code right, James 315 in the new order of high sec high sec is governed by code and is ruled by the new order yeah okay that's just the Sorry, I've been seeing them spam a lot in chat, and it's very annoying. They're like, oh, pay a certain amount of money, or, you know, we will blow you out of the sky. Fine, blow me out of the sky. Don't care. Don't, I do not deal with dictators. Especially when they're a bunch of taters who are dicks. Ha <laughs> ha. Uh, terrible joke, I know. But me and the old noisy cricket don't care. Also, one of the new things that they're changing, because there's an update as well as the Christmas stuff today. I probably mentioned it. Um, you'll no longer, corporations will no longer be able to be war decked or war, declared war upon unless they have a structure, which is fantastic news for me because I don't have a structure. And so war decking me is kind of pointless. There we go. But no, if y'all have any questions about some of the new stuff coming to Eve, I will leave a link in the description of this video. Remember, self, link, description, video. To that. Drive active. Uh, to the update info. Yeah, I don't think that actually is... No. Hmm. Oh, well. He's like sitting there for quite some time. That adventure. Emilio's Rem Emilio's Remuses. <laughs> Alright. Back to my main job. This is just my side job. So now that I have level 2 security missions open, that'll be next video. We will dip our toes in some level 2 stuff. Watch our ship get blown out of the water. I'm trying to remember. I think I fit the deuce coop with some medium uh, turrets. If I didn't, I need to now that I have the training for it.
Oh, somebody. Ooh. talking about how code ganked them when they were ice mining. Guess it's a good thing I'm not mining lately. I'd get peeved. Uh, yep, happens every time. Yeah, they'll have one dude sitting in a cloak and he'll set up a jump point with the cloak, or the, I forget the module. But if they have the proper stuff fit, they can jump in on top of it and they'll just pile drive you. They will straight drop the hurt. Uh, no thanks, darling. Not yet. We're gonna go grab my dude and move some freight. Uh, set destination. Thank you. Undock. Do I have time though? That is, therein lies the true question. Do I have the time? Ooh, not really. Cluster will be shut down in about 20 minutes, so. Maybe we can get out there. Maybe not. Let's pull this up. My contracts. You the contract. Add the waypoint. Okay, not terrible. This is what's going to hurt. Yeah. We're going to have to, like, go. Straight boogie out of here. 23 drop. Admittedly, 23 jumps is not terrible in comparison to when I was in Amari space doing this. Because then it was, like, 30 jumps. And I need to check out some stuff in the market over there in um, Gita anyways. And I just realized my directional scanner, y'all probably can't see that very well because my logo is down there. I'm actually probably going to take that out. I mean, it's handy, don't get me wrong, but at the same time, I, I gotta make it smaller. It's huge. Let's all go to Jeta. Let's all go to Jeta. I have noticed though that yeah, there's some Talking industry stuff requested. here, but I can't do Talking any research accepted. to make it cheaper for me to make. I wonder if that's in training. I wonder if I have not. I thought I trained it, but I may not have. Let's see. Oh, no, that's right. I have. It's not available here. That's not what I wanted. Uh, industry. Yeah, there's, there's no research in this station. Let's see. Yeah, activity not supported in the facility. So, I gotta find somewhere that has that around here. I can make it, but I need a lot more of absolutely everything. Megasite, Mexlon. Yeah, I may buy some of this while I'm in Gita. Start kicking out a few of these uh, crucifiers. Maximum run time, 557. <laughs> cost 5,000 is so yeah let's go ahead and pull out our handy dandy notepad uh, new note type new note label crucifier mats thank you alright so of course tritanium tritanium 
3k. Oh, uh, pyrite. Twelve point twenty two K Mexlon So one need one thousand three hundred and thirty three Isogen. We only need two so gen. Two hundred and seventy-eight <coughs> Noxium Sium eighty-three, which I need to make copies of that. I need to definitely find somewhere I can make copies. Zy drain C twenty-two. And megasite twelve site. I mean, technically, I can make the big tier ships, which is pretty awesome. Cool. Thank you. All right. Ships. Ship. Okay. Bruce Fire Mats. Put you in chips. Sweet. Okay. Got it. Get it. Got it. Good. Let's grab the Doomstick. Mega active. And we will boogie. <clears throat> like I said, even though I am slowly getting into combat, my main focus is still industry just because I really like the industry side of it, mainly this, but I also want to get into crafting some stuff. Jump through the Stargate. Little Avenger going out. So cute! Go, little buddy! Mine away! Oh, one of these days. Jeez, am I just gonna like drift until I finally kick it in? Didn't think that was ever gonna happen. Ah. As I'm going though, I'm gonna be keeping an eye out on some of the star ports around, so to speak. <laughs> so that I can take that blueprint and make copies of it. What we got? Uh, show info. Services. Industry. Uh, I guess I'm just gonna have to like fly around. Oh, the testing facilities. Hmm, I'll have to remember that. Okay, let's get. I'll probably do more of that off camera than anything. Another ship that I thought about getting. I know I'm just rambling now. I'm getting tired. It is now almost three o'clock in the morning. It's about time for me to go to back to bed. I've been up for about an hour and a half. That seems to be my norm anymore. Is I'll lay down about 8:30, wake up about one, goof off on here for a little bit because it's easier for me to record at night because the wife's either asleep or for the next like three weeks she's gonna be at work the kids asleep I can finally get on games that I want to get on
but I digress. One of the other ships that I've thought about getting into, for if I don't feel like taking out the Orca, is the Porpoise. Which is pretty much just a smaller version of the Yorka. It just doesn't have the space and whatnot. But it's got it's still got the the Foreman burst. It's got shield boosts. Drone, yield, you know, mining foreman burst, all of it. But I need to train it a little more. Right now I've only got you know, mastery level one. It seems to be the story of my life. I have everything but these transport barges and stuff. I only have mastery level one, but I have mastery level one on a lot. Like a ridiculous amount. And Kaldari. Ooh, well, I'm a G guy. I can go ahead and get the diplomacy book. That'd be handy. And the handiest. Anyways. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Uh. Oh. I was like, did I just get paid? Ah, oh, bounty prizes. There we are. And see, once I get up to level 3 and level 4, those bounty prizes will be up to like millions. Millions and millions and millions and billions and billions and millions. And millions. Yeah, not really, but. I can dream. If I could get to where a mission would pay out about a mil at a time, <sighs> I'd grind missions for months. Wouldn't do nothing but grind missions. The only thing that I really have to worry about in the mission is losing, you know, the boat and drones. And it's not nearly as likely as losing a boat. Ugh, running low second stuff. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting we're going to go through Concord space. It blows my mind for some reason. Concord here is running Galente ships, but the jump gate is a Mari design. I don't know. And please don't think that there's actually any particular bad guy. If you read some of the lore, they're all bad guys. There really, there really is, you know, no white or black, good or evil in this. It's just a bunch of gray. It's just what shade do you want and what flavor of evil do you want to deal with? I actually will agree. I will completely agree. Oh, okay. He was talking about running belts and killing bots. Yeah. People still bot in this game. It really annoys me. I'm fairly certain HZO... Is, just, is nothing but a bunch of bots because they only go out at certain times they only run the uh, ventures and one or two bestowers and I've never once you know I never once the whole time I was stationed in Amari had any of them talk to me and so I can't blame you The only downside is to the war deck thing, back on that topic, is I actually had thought about getting myself just a small uh, building and throwing it out in space somewhere to call my own home. But now that that's a thing, I feel like people are going to just go around and war deck anybody that has a structure. So I guess I'm going to stick away from structures for a while until I get more court ma mates, members, people, friends, family, whatever you want to call them. Excuse me. Interbus. We're in interbus space now. Okay. Kill. Everybody's pretty much getting off for the night, so I'm just gonna minimize these. 
Oh, sadly, it is very late. It'll probably be... Let's see, it's 2.55 now. It'll probably be 3.20 before we park. But, uh, this is my normal routine. Make a little uh, side isk, so to speak. And it's even better when I don't have to go through orange blops. Holy massive, massive jump gate. Our docking station. Drive <clears throat> yeah, for some reason we kind of went around Calente space. I don't know. It's weird. Teleho. Yeah, gonna look at that. I'm also gonna look at possibly getting a few blueprints for some Tech Two ships. Some bigger tech two. That was a tech two frigate, which is actually kind of easy to do. Gonna do that. Grab the stuff to make a, about five or six of those crucifiers if I can. We're also gonna see how much those crucifiers are going for, if it's even worth. So many things I'm gonna do before I get off. Probably got another 30 minutes, 40 minutes on this video. So if you. <laughs> Don't want to sit around and just listen to me yak my brain off for a little bit. You might as well just click off now. What the? Ooh, that's an interesting looking like ceiling. Hmm. Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. Oh, okay, that's the dome over the interior city. Oh, there's a lake in there. Oh, I'd live there. I have always been curious as to what it would be like to. Get um to walk around some of these stations. Oh, nitrogen fuel block. Ooh, echelon. Ah, yep. More stuff for a station. Actually, they must be building this stuff and sending it off, which is cool. Oh, it's me and deadlock. Okay. Hi, Deadlock. How are you? Hmm? How are you, dear? Lovey. Yeah, now I understand why they want a 300 mil collateral. Pretty much the stuff I've got in my cargo hold right now is worth that. Yeah, 373 mil. So, 4 million makes sense. How much are these bits going for? 20, 28, 4... 159? Jeez! Stand up heavy energy newt. I'm curious. I haven't ever seen one of those. Show info on that boat. It's a small... Of these ships was released to Capsuleers at the end of year 112 as a platform to utilize an influx of. Huh. Oh, this is a rare ship. Cool. I think. I say that. I, there are probably millions of them. Okay. I'm all, I'll admit, I probably shouldn't do that. I probably shouldn't show what they're selling or whatnot. But by the time you'll see this video, it's probably going to be like a week after I've ran this stuff, so it doesn't really matter. It's probably been sold. I'm just always curious, you know? I feel like that's my right as a trucker to know the manifest of the cargo that I'm pulling. I mean, y'all may disagree, but that's the way I feel about it. Only 14 jumps left, boys and girls. We'll be doing all right. All night long, all night. Hmm? I think my little external hard drive just crapped out on me. That's not good. That had all the videos. Ugh. 
I've been trying to keep my hard drives clean because of the late. I've been bad about just filling it up with junk and my computer's been taking a hit performance wise because of it. And so I have this little external dock that you can take an internal hard drive and dock it kind of like an external hard drive. <laughs> I've been cutting my videos and putting it on it and then when I want to edit I literally just click over because it's got a USB 3.0 and edit through that hard drive but the thing is is I was using a very old single dock one well this one is a new two dock where worst case scenario if I want to back up anything I pop a secondary drive in the thing and I hit back or hit the button on the front of the dock and it just instantly backs up to the other hard drive which is nice it pretty much clones the drive, which is cool. But it's it's a bit of a fickle beast. It had great reviews on Newegg, don't get me wrong, and I, I'm probably just being a dummy and not doing it right. And it's probably in like sleep mode to keep from grinding the drive to death. But I took I went to take that hard drive with my old doc to work and edit some videos while I was at work and for some reason the drive wouldn't show up in the other doc. So I'm kind of curious. Alright, let's jump to that. I was about to tell y'all how long or what time it was, but I'm going to throw a challenge at y'all. Y'all tell me how, how, what time it is. <laughs> how long it's been since the last I said the time. Let's just say I'm hating life. Vegeta. Uh, I'm going to close the scanner just because we're running through some pretty high sec areas. I'll pull it back up if we when we get to... Uh, Dama. Dama. Yeah, the other like minded individuals like me running freight. Oh, I miss my obelisk. <coughs> but, I'm saving the money for that. I could technically get Plex and sell it and you know, be a tool, but I'd rather not. Uh, local. Yeah, you're gonna blink every time I go through something new. So I'm just gonna keep local pulled up. Because if not, like I said, it freaks out. It gets mad. <sighs> really? Somebody actually talked in the radio. Apparently they know each other. I admittedly I probably should talk and chat more, but I, half the time I don't care what they're talking about. I don't know, that's kind of you know sad. That's me being judgy, but whatever. I have talked to a handful of times on Eve Radio. I also need let's see. Uh da 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 uh, channels haulers yeah I'm part of the haulers even though it's, it's the only player channel Let's see Linux no trade no Eve University ah yes I actually Ah. No. Yeah, they changed. Okay. 
<clears throat> That's good to know. Though. I had seen somebody on that chat in a video that was probably done years ago. I was just curious if it was still a thing. Whew. It's getting way too early for this. Way too early for this. Let's see. Emails. What? Has anybody sent me email? Yee, not on the game. Let's see, today is Tuesday, right? Yes. Okay, good. Alright, my bosses are at my case about sending in projected timesheets on Wednesdays now so they can try to monitor and help minimalize my overtime for my guys. And I'm like, y'all don't want us to have overtime, send us people. And I've got an alarm set, so I do it on Wednesdays, but the, I thought if, you know, I lose track, time's going strange, it's weird. The Forge. Sivala. Eight jumps into it, we have finally made it to Caldari Estate. Borrow? Oh, mobile detail. Borrow up to, ah. <laughs> It's allowed in the game, so that is one thing that I don't like about all the MMOs I played. This one, Final Fantasy XIV, <laughs> all of them. Is you get gold spammers, as they call it in this game, Eve spammer, E yes, yeah. wow. Brain pan work, please. Point five, but there's still more than enough Concord and Caldari Customs agents here. But hopefully something might happen if somebody tried to attack me. I'm not gonna say it won't happen, but I personally have never had it happen in you know point five. Oh, I'm not in point five yet. I'm in point six. So the next one, the Citadel. But as I've said, I've never personally had it happen. that I got shot at in the point five. It is possible though. Artist of some kind, or quarter rating artist. Jump to the Stargate. I want a bowhead. And here comes the Finmer. Oh. I do apologize if it gets to the point where I don't think I'm being very entertaining to you guys when I watch this video over again. I'm gonna just time lapse from there until I get to Jita. Because I can tell. About this time of night, and I don't know if y'all are the same way, but my brain like slows down a bit. My focus either goes one of two ways. I either get kind of, you know, all over the place where I can't focus really well, or I hyper focus to the point where I stop talking because I'm focused on the game itself. And so it's kind of a double edged sword recording this late at night. It could either turn out to be some amazing footage, or it can turn out to be some just pants footage. I'll let y'all decide which is which. That's why I don't like talking to people this late at night. Because I'm bad about the, the message will go off and I'll be like, oh, okay, okay, message. I'll get in a second and I'll set the phone back down. And then I'll forget. And then I'll be like, oh crap, I'll look down, it's been 10 to 15 minutes, and I was like, uh, I'm sorry. 
But I feel like a lot of people do that. Not just me, the, the message thing. Brave. I wish my cork was big enough that I could do that. I hate time zones. Hmm. I wonder when the cluster is going down. It's normally this time. Did I miss it? Was I not paying attention? Nope. Oop, I didn't miss it. Okay. Ugh, oh, I gotta do my push ups for a little bit too. A bit. <sighs> trying, trying to get back fit. I was doing good and then winter rolled around and it's kind of hard to get out and do anything because it's cold. And then with a the wife working in the evenings, I try to be home so she can rest. Okay. You know? Before um, she has to go to work. And so. I'm having to force myself to work out here at the house. So one of the things that I'm really pushing, you know, trying to do a lot, is push-ups. Because I don't know about y'all, but as a guy, for some reason, the weight not only sits around my stomach, it sits around my chest, and it's kind of awkward. Yeah, boobs, man, boobs, it's a thing. And so I found push-ups help that. They also help with your upper body strength, which is something that I've always struggled with. Leg strength, you got it all day long. Core strength, I'm like a god. Upper body strength, that ah, crap. Oh, the Seeker's Investigation. I just, I just, I need to do that because I get stuff from it. It's just a bit of a pain. It's just long and it's drawn out and it's just annoying. Ship through the Stargate. We're almost there, guys. We're almost. I ain't gonna lie, I'm parking my butt in Cheetah and I'm not coming back tonight. It's just way too late. It would be another ridiculous amount of space, or time. Yeah, here, let's see. Add waypoint. Yeah, 14 jumps. Also need to save location. Wait, I've already done that. Yeah, I've already done that. So many mining and admin stuff for the Caldari out here. That's wow, that's ridiculous. Oh, I bet you I could take that blueprint out here and copy it. I was real dumb. Yeah, honestly, I just need to sit on blueprints out here. scared me for a second. I forgot I had said the home station is part of, yeah. I was dumb. I looked over. I was like, wait a minute, wait a minute. I thought I was almost there. Nerf. Oh, the Happy Eve music. I love it so much. It's it's great. Wow, this video is already 19.2 gigabytes. This ought to be <laughs> Rip. I'm the same way. When I wake up, I'm normally awake. Rarely can I just lay back down and go to sleep. Ah, Sisters of Eve ship. You can normally tell because it'll have that round bit at the back. Drive active. There's a 
Gnosis. At first I was worried about playing with those and losing it. I'd be like, oh, I'll never get another one. But if you look at the market, there's actually a lot of those ships. There is a whole lot of those ships. <laughs> And it just dawned on me, I'm fascinated by a game of spaceships. Oh, I thought that would never happen. I used to be terrified at the thought of going to space. Man, it's like, it's all get out over here. Is everybody in Jita today? What is... Whoa, that's why. Oh, oh my frame tanked there. It's, it's still tanking there. What the heck? I... I'm trying to remember the <laughs> mobile tracker unit. Slick Java, where criminals will not be tolerated. We will kill you. Industrial ship construction. Got that. The advanced small ship construction. Oh, just get me in the space dock. That is like awful. Docking permission requested. Advanced frigates and destroyers. That's what I'm after. Some destroyers. Please, Doc, don't do this. Oh, you're, yeah, I was about to say you're being dumb. Wow. They... Wow. One moment they were there, the next moment they were gone. Cool. Let's drop this off. And we're going to take a bit of a look for a moment. I got about ten more minutes. Out of here. There you are. I have delivered Joe Freighter. Complete. Yes. Yay, got my money back. Alright, let's look at the old market here. Blueprints. That's what I'm after. Some blueprints. Ships. Um, let's do Galente. Shoo! Oof. Holy yowza. Okay. What we got cruiser wise? That's not as bad. Still a hundred mil. Uh, okay. Bad thing is, I can't do anything industry because I have nothing in this system. So, yeah, no blueprints in the system. You gotta have them in the system. Uh, I'm gonna add that to the quick bar. <laughs> I said it was. There, add to the market quick bar. The Exwitter. Exequitor. I'm going to add all these for right now. Alright, let's see how much these are going for in the market. Curator. Search. Search. 
ship. Except we're Navy issue. 59 mil. Ugh, press history. It has stayed fairly steady. Not terrible, not great. We've dipped to a low, but it's slowly on the high. Uh, do I have the skills to run that though? Show info. Should be able to. The gecko's actually staying pretty easy. Yeah. That's expensive, but I'm gonna go ahead. Yeah, it's like not above, it's not below. Thorax. Thorax Navy issue. Alright, uh, uh, Thorax. Oof. Okay, what is the Thorax rolling for? It's only going for six mil. That's not worth. That's got to be a low. No, it's staying pretty well. It's normal. Uh, what is it? Hey, show detail. It's still not great. The blueprints. Oh, the blueprints are at an all-time high. That's why. Okay. Vexers. Because I love my Vexer. This is a pretty normal. It's another 91 mil. I'm going to go ahead and buy this. Yeah, it's a little above regional value, but I, I can live with it. Alright, uh, now that I'm here, let's see what we can do industry-wise with those two. <sighs> really? I can run that 279 times. 279. Yeah, I can't copy it. It's not supported at the facility. I'm actually probably going to have to take these to somebody's station. Which is fine. Uh, see, I think the only thing I wouldn't be able to get is the Noxium. Oh, that's 330 something thousand isk. That's, uh, that's almost a million. Gonna have to. Wow, yeah, I'm gonna have to go mine a lot of this myself. Alright. Well, boys and girls, we've been at it an uh, hour and 23 minutes. I'm gonna end. I hope y'all enjoyed. If y'all have any recommendations or consternations, let me know in oh, the comments, and if you want to see more, hit the old thumbs up and subscribe button, and we'll catch you on the next one. Good luck, God bless.